Hi, my name is Dominique. I'm a production technician here at Video Gear, and today I'm going to show you how to install a teleprompter. You have the laptop, the frame, monitor, camera mount, and tripod. The first thing I want to do is make sure that the camera mount, monitor, and glass frame are securely connected to the tripod. From there, I want to install the power supply to the monitor. Set the gla glass frame up. Lock it and remove the phone. From there, I want to install the camera onto the camera mount. Once that's locked and secure, I want to make the adjustment of the glass frame so that I can securely install the camera inside the hood. From there, I want to move the camera inside the hood and properly secure the hood around the camera's lens. Now that we have that locked and secure, we're ready to install the VGA cable into the back of the laptop. Before starting the application and turning on the laptop, make sure that you take the VGA cable and put it into the laptop before you turn on the power. Now that the laptop recognizes a monitor, there are a few key settings that you want to make sure you have in order to keep these working properly. You want to make sure that the laptop and the display are synced in the one, two position. You can find that by right clicking, going down to properties, click settings, click on the second monitor, and check the box that says extend my Windows desktop. Hit apply and click OK. Both laptop and monitor are now recognizing each other. The software that we use by prompter people is known as FlipQ. Double click it, let's turn it on. Before we get the teleprompter going, I want to make sure and let you know that docx files will not work. You need a doc file, an RTF, or a TXT. Click the open file, find your document, and load it. You can increase the size of the font by pressing F5 or decreasing it by pressing F6. One key note, in order for you to see the teleprompter in the monitor properly, you must take the secondary monitor and change it to mirror. Once you have that ready, it is now time to use FlipQ. 
click the lightning bolt and you're ready to go. Adjust the speed by using our wheel to go fast, slow, or go back to your original spot. There you have it. I'm Dominique. Have a good day. Hey, if you love gear and knowledge as much as we do, then subscribe to our channel by clicking our logo. Here are a couple more videos for your enjoyment.